Hey y'all, welcome back. Today we're gonna to be talking about how to get the look, what look? The luxury look for less. So if you are interested in that, stay tuned. Welcome back to what I'm on today. My name is Lakia Chanel. And if you are new to the channel, welcome. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you have been here before and you are subscribed, I appreciate you joining the tribe. Um, for those of you guys who are new, I make videos, a lot of videos about contemporary luxury handbags, fashion, and how to save a coin, money matters, okay? So today, like I mentioned, I wanna talk about how to get the luxury look for less. Don't get me wrong. I love a luxury piece, I love a luxury bag, and I love some luxury shoes every once in a while as well, but I also love to save a coin and also get some really, really luxurious pieces at great prices. I don't care whether my things are luxury or contemporary or no brand at all. I wanna make sure that I'm getting it at the best price that I can and that is the best quality. So I have some things that are in my closet or some things that are on my wish list that are contemporary brands, but they are also very luxurious and they remind me of luxury pieces. So today I want to talk to you about some accessories, um, shoes, and handbags that you can get to get the looks of some of these luxurious brands. So the first thing that I want to talk about is accessories. As you guys know, Coach is my baby. Everything that I have, for the most part, with the exception of this bag I'm going to show you, um, that is an SLG is from Coach. I mean, most of their things are all leather or really nice coated canvas. They're most of the time under $200. And it is very difficult for me to like even consider getting any type of SLG from any other brand, especially a luxury brand. My husband laughs at me all the time because he's like, you have a Chanel bag, but you have a Coach wallet in that Chanel bag. Um, yes, sir. I'm gonna spend my coins, if I'm gonna spend thousands of dollars, it is going to be on a bag and not a little accessory. So the first thing I wanted to um, show you guys was this baby. So this is like my only non-coach SLG. I originally bought it as a handbag, um, but I have been using it 90% of the time um, as a catch-all for my handbags. And this is very, very similar to the Nolita 19 by my favorite coach. So the difference is the Nolita 19 is 100% um, leather, where as you know, this is coated canvas. Um, it fits about the same. As you can see, this fits um, you know, my phone. The Nolita 19, if you guys look up here as well, will fit your phone and other accessories. They both have a strap that can be used as a wristlet or a full handbag strap. Apologies, I don't have my strap in because I'm actually using this right now. Um, this right here retails for $730, where the Nolita 19 retails right now for $67 on the Coach Outlet. I mean, $67 for a full leather bag compared to $730 for a coated canvas piece. And don't get me wrong, this is a great throw in your bag piece or you're going somewhere really quickly and you need a short little um, handbag. This is great for that, the Nolita as well. So if you're looking for this type of look for something that is way more affordable, check out the Nolita 19. And I'm recording this video right now um, and right now this is on sale for $67 and some change, okay? You can't beat that. Next, I wanna go into shoes. So I have been, um, like shoes are my first love, and then come handbags. So I love these shoes. I recently bought them. They are the Sam Edelman Lorraine Bit Loafer. Um, you can get these anywhere. They sell these at Nordstrom Rack, Bloomingdale's, Nordstrom, Nima Marcus, and of course on the Sam Edelman site. Looking at them, I'm sure that they remind you of something. They remind you of, of course, the Gucci loafer. Um, the Gucci loafer has a similar bit. Um, the leather is soft. I actually have a couple of pair of these and I recently bought two more pair because they were so 
freaking comfortable and well made. So if you can see, these are all leather. They have this great um, gold bit detail. Um, you can tell like how well made, in my opinion, a shoe is by the bottom of it. And these are like really, really nicely well made shoes shoes so very similar to the gucci loafer if you want to get that look they come in all different types of colors as you can see i have it in the smooth leather as well as this kind of textured um croc mock croc leather as well um both of the shoes do the similar thing that the gucci shoe does where um, you can wear it if you want it to as a mule so it does have that soft back where you can wear it as a mule. And that's not only for the smooth leather one. Um, it's also true for the mock crop leather one as well. So pretty cool. Price differences. So the Gucci loafer is currently going for $830. Um, on the Gucci website. So I think that they go on sale like a Neiman Marcus and stuff like that. So you can probably catch them on a sale, maybe for $100 less. Um, these Sam Edelman's retail for $130. They are, you can always catch these on a sale. Like I said, you can even get these at um, Nordstrom Rack. I paid $60 for these um, at Macy's. And then I got these for $60 at, um, I think, Bloomingdale's. So you can always find them on a sale for over half off, which are great. And y'all, when I tell you these are comfortable and they really do elevate um, your look, trust me, they really do. The next shoe that I wanted to tell you guys about um, is this shoe right here. So let me get the name of it right before um, I mess it up. So this is the Sheer Pointed Toe Evening Pump by Badgley Mishka. I haven't had a chance to wear these yet. I got these this summer. Um, I mean, and I wanted these so badly. Now, guys, I mean, by looking at these, you already know exactly what shoe they look like. First off, aren't these so freaking gorgeous? Like these are so beautiful, so freaking vibrant. I cannot wear to, wait to like wear them outside of the house. Remember I told you, you can tell a nicely made shoe by the bottom and the bottom is so beautiful and silky smooth. And I mean, these are just fantastic, okay? These of course remind you of the Manolo Blahnik Hangisis. Um, the Hangisis, are going for $995, okay? And very similar. I mean, the look is so similar. So I saw the Hangisis in person, and for me, and I love a Manolo, for me, I liked the Badgley Miska better because I liked how pointy the toe is. And if you look at the Hangisis, they kind of curve up and have like a little bit more rounded toe. Now, don't get me wrong. They are absolutely gorgeous like ridiculously gorgeous. Um, but I love these for the price. So these retail for $230. Remember the hang ECs, 995. Um, and you can always, I'm not going to say always, but you can find these on sale. I got them this summer for $167, which I thought was an absolute steal. So they have these in all different colors, just like the hang ECs. Um, and I mean, these are just such a great, this is like my favorite of the dupes, I think, are these because they are so similar um, and so beautiful. So I definitely recommend these as well. If you're gonna get these, get a half size bigger than your size though, FYI. Now we're going to get into handbags. So there are a couple of handbags that I think are just the bee's knees and that are very good substitutes. So the first one I am going to show you guys is the um i don't actually own either one of these bags right now um but this bag is on my wish list it's by coach it is the alley shoulder bag 18 and the similar 
uh, in the signature Jaguar with snakeskin detail. And I want you guys to look at how similar it looks to the Christian Dior 30 Montaigne bag. And I could not for the life of me, like, understand why I was just loving that you guys if you've seen my wish list video you know that I really want this coach bag this alley bag and it, it just caught my attention immediately and I'm like I need you to go on sale real quick but I love you so this bag is $495 um it is a coach bag from the coach site so you already know it is well made and it's great um it I'm waiting to purchase it for when it goes on sale because I know it's going to go on sale at some point. It'll probably go on sale in the spring since it's a very like winter fall y color. So this is $4.95 right now. The 30 Montaigne bag um, in the Blue Dior Oblique Jaguar, which is gorgeous. As you guys can see, they look very similar um, with the difference of obviously the hardware. This bag is retailing for $3,800. So $495 to $3,800. I knew about this coach bag before I even knew about this Dior bag, but I was looking on the Dior website and I'm like, ooh, this looks very similar to the coach. So I'm definitely going to get this look for less when it's even more less, okay? Um, the next bag I wanted to show you guys was the Speedy and the Boston bag from MCM. So I love MCM. I have some of their pieces, like really, really great, great quality pieces. So this is the Speedy. You guys probably know this is the one with the bandolier. So it has, you know, the strap that you can click on to the bag, um, which makes it amazing for me. This is in the size 25 um, and it has the, you know, coated canvas and the logo. All right, this bag, I think retails for $1,600 now. Um, I think when I got it, it was like $1,500 and some change, but it's $1,600 and some change now for the Speedy Bandolier. Um, this is like one of my favorite bags in my collection. I love it. I wear it all the time. Um, but it's still a pricey bag, right? Now, look at this bag. And now I need you to look at the essential boston bag investos original by mcm now is that not giving you like very similar feels so that bag by mcm is 795 dollars um compared to the 1600 and some change for this bag it also has um, a detachable strap um and then this bag is in their coated canvas as well and it has leather <coughs> leather handles um, as well. So, I mean, really great alternative. Um, and I love the brand MCM as well. So great alternative, actually great brand for getting the look for less. Okay. Um, the next bag, um, on my list is going to be from Tory Burch. And it's also looking at that bag. Um, and the Lulu. <clears throat> so I purchased this bag originally because I really wanted the YSL Lulu bag. Um, and I didn't want to spend at the time the money for the YSL Lulu bag. And it was just on my wish list. And then I saw this bag at Tory Burch. And I was like, oh, this gives me like the same kind of vibe. Um, but for way less. So this is a great bag. Like I love this bag. This is um, called the Tory Burch Kira Convertible Bag. It's an all leather bag in lambskin. Okay. So guys, even though we're talking about getting the look for less, all of these things that I am showing you are like very high quality things. Okay. I'm not talking about getting a plastic bag or a non-leather bag or you know something that's just not as good in terms of quality we're talking about great quality pieces made with great materials so this is made of um lambskin has the flap and it has great pockets inside very similar with the the chain that you can double up or single down now look at the ysl lulu bag very very similar 
Um, the size that would probably be equivalent to this would probably be, I mean, maybe the toy or the small. The toy Lulu is $1,250. Um, if you wanted to size up and get the small, that is $2,050. The Tory Burch Kira bag is $528. Um, and again, it is one of those bags that more than likely you are going to be able to get on sale. So I purchased mine a year or two ago, and I don't know, it was maybe two or three hundred dollars. I know right now uh, Tory Burch is having a um, private sale, and they have this in yellow and a couple of other colors. And they are $2.99. So again, we're talking about anywhere from $300 to $528 for your Tory Burch bag, which is giving you all the feels, okay, of that nice plushy coated leather lambskin. By the way, the YSL bag is also made of lambskin um, for, for that great price. Um, or the YSL bag between $1,200 and $2,000, depending on the size. Don't get me wrong, YSL is great. They have great quality bags. But if you are looking for a similar type of look, but you don't have a thousand to two thousand dollars for that, I'm going to tell you to go to Tory Burch right now and get this for two hundred and ninety nine dollars in a, a different colorway. Okay, I mean it's great. And the last bag that I wanted to talk about was, and I feel like there are a couple of companies that do this very well um but is the chanel mini which is always loved and coveted i have nothing bad to say about the chanel mini um other than this bag is four thousand dollars um it is made of either lambskin or calfskin leather but i think all the minis now come in lambskin um and they start out at four thousand dollars Okay, they come in all different colors. I think that they're well made. I, I love a Chanel bag. Um, but if you are not trying to drop $4,000 on a Chanel bag, but you want the look, um, I have just found out about this brand. This is like so new to me, this brand. And this brand is called Kirk Geiger. And um, I was lucky enough to get this little bag. Um, and I thought that it was a good comparison because it's like metallic, metallic. You guys know that the Chanel bags come in all different types of beautiful colors. These bags also come in really, really great colors. Um, and this is called the Kurt Geiger um, Kensington. The mini Kensington is the type of bag that this is. Um, just to kind of give you guys a quick little look around of this bag if you've never seen it. So obviously they are, you know, different bags, but I'm talking about giving you the same type of feel. This is an all leather bag um, as well. Um, the price point on this bag is $195. Um, and of course the price point on this bag is going to be $4,000. Um, I think that they fit similarly this may fit a little bit less than the, um, I've never compared them prior to this, but this, this uh, Kensington may fit a little bit less than the, um, the mini. Um, but when I'm talking about vibrant colors and, and bags that stand out, I love this. So you can see the insignia here. It's very classic to Kurt Geiger. And it's like so different. It kind of, again, it's not similar, but it's very, you know, you see the, the Coco Chanel, the double C's, and it's very standout-ish. And I think this little hawk or bird is very standout-ish. So instead of the um, turn lock of the Chanel bag, you have um, the flaps, the double flaps, the flap here. And then it opens up and you can kind of put all the good stuff in here. But they, it, it's just such a cool, colorful bag. It's such a teeny, tiny little statement piece. Um, it comes with, you know, two grommets. And I haven't worn this yet, so I still have all of the stuff in it. But it's kind of the same idea where you can kind of pull it. You can cross body it. You can do whatever you want, you know, with this bag. 
Um, this Chanel Mini has one grommet, but you get the idea. You can kind of do the same thing. Um, but I thought that this would be like a really, really cool comparison of um, a good contemporary brand that is very similar and giving you Chanel vibes. The other bag that I thought was very similar, I use similar loosely. Um, it is called the Coach. This is new from um, the Coach line. I've never seen this bag before, um, this particular colorway, but it's called the Madison Shoulder Bag 16 with quilting. And if you look up there, this to me also kind of gives you like that Chanel vibe, but it has its own little Coach swag to it. Um, very similar. Um, it has the interwoven leather, you know, chain, very similar to your Chanel. It has a turn lock, um, which is of course very similar to your Chanel as well. And this is super cute. This bag is $350, um, compared to the, uh, $4,000. And I don't remember if I told you guys how much this bag costs. This bag is... Um, $195. Um, and then you can probably, as with most of these bags, find them on sale. Um, Bloomingdale sells these. You can get them from the Kirk Geiger. Um, you can get it as well from the Kirk Geiger London site. I think Neiman Marcus sells this. Um, and then for some pieces of the brand, you can even get it from like Nordstrom Rack as well. So, I mean, for a price point, $195 for a fully leather bag and these metallics with this type of detailing on it, I think is phenomenal. So those are my picks and it's so crazy. There's many more. I feel like I have many more things in my closet that are such high quality, that are very dupish of luxury pieces. Um, that I can share with you, but these are kind of some of the ones that I thought were immediate ones that I kind of wear a lot or at least want to wear a lot um, within my collection. So if you guys didn't get anything else from this video, just get the idea that you don't have to spend thousands to look fabulous. You don't even have to spend hundreds if you don't want to. Um, if you want to get a look, there's always something out there. These trends are trends. So if you find something on Louis Vuitton or Chanel or Gucci or any of these other brands, it's a trend. So that means that there are going to be more than just that company that is doing that trend. So you can always find it for less um, at really cool contemporary brands. So I hope this was helpful. Feel free to get any of these lovely things because I love them all. Um, and thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you enjoy um, videos like this, don't be afraid to like, subscribe, tell your friends. Also, I am on Instagram under the same handle, what underscore I'm underscore on underscore today. Um, and also feel free to check out the blog at what I'm on today.com. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you. And as I always say, I will see you in my next video. Bye. Remind me of 12th grade. Remind me of young shade. Feel like a new shoe.